not a lot of time to dwell on what could have been, Chuck. We've got 24 hours to turn around against Brisbane Heat. Absolutely. So lick our wounds and we're on tomorrow against the Heat um, at Adelaide Oval. So big uh, big fan, striker fan down at the ground and the equation's pretty simple now. Two games, win both of them. Played some really good cricket last night. I was proud of the efforts, but you know, someone said to me on Twitter, effort doesn't get you the result, coach, and they're right. Uh, we needed to get over the line, we didn't, so now we, we have one simple choice. We beat the Heat, and then we beat the Renegades, and we play finals. Probably does sit in the guts since it's one that got away, but you, you take a lot of confidence from it, don't you, with you know, guys like John O'Dean on debut, um, obviously Husey back in the corner as well. Yeah, Husey at the top was really good. John O'Dean got 29 off 15 balls. That's exactly why we picked him. Uh, he'd been waiting for an opportunity, and, and he delivered. Even Travis Head, albeit brief, Travis got 17 off nine balls. So couldn't question the commitment of any of our batsmen to what our game plan is, and that's what we've been searching for. The last couple of games, we ha we have we've stumbled with the bat. So we got back on track last night. Uh, our bowling probably wasn't red hot and our fielding was poor last night. So we still haven't put all three facets of the game together. Uh, but again, I know if we do that we're this side that we've got is capable of anything. So that's the focus for the Brisbane game. We owe Brisbane one for, for the loss, last ball loss last year. No Christian, Ryan Harris back to the side. I guess it's going to be interesting uh, coming up against them. Uh, they're a good side. They won it last year and uh, they've got some dangerous players and some in really good form. So we've got to be ready to go and prepared to hit the ground running tomorrow because if we bring anything less than our best, Brisbane Heat will kick us because they've got a very good side. and. You know, this big bash table, I don't think positions really reflect. You know, anyone can beat anybody. And uh, Brisbane Heat and Renegades are both behind us. Uh, but, you know, I rate them as, as finals opposition as well. So it's a tough comp and, and we enjoy the tough comp and we've got to, we've got to bounce back tomorrow. Just lastly, tough decision uh, with Maxi Klinger coming back to the side, I guess. Who do you drop? It's a tough one, isn't it, for you to, to make overnight? Well, firstly, it's great that we've got Maxi Klinger back, obviously, as a class player. Um, and yeah, it is a tough decision that the selectors will have to debate this afternoon that someone's going to be stiff. But again, that's what you want in good sides. You've got to make tough decisions. If the decisions are easy, that's normally a sign of a poor side. If there's tough decisions and good players are missing out, and that's what will happen this game, one or two players that will expect to play, we're going to have to tap them on the shoulder and say, sorry, you're out. But that, that's what happens at the top. Good luck. Thanks.